a better Lagos is possible. Uh, that should be a collective effort from both the residents of Lagos. Uh, this is just uh, what it looks like after the a little downpour. You can sight uh, all the way how the rain, uh, the debris are flowing after the rain, the, everywhere is looking so littered with uh, uh, plastics and non-biodegradable uh, elements, nylon polythene bags flowing on the streets of Lagos. You can see them and uh, people are just uh, <laughs> uh, well, for me, a better Lagos is possible only if the appropriate authorities can uh, be proactive, especially now that the rainy seasons are here again. We learned, of course, uh, in the previous rainy season, of course, we experienced not just land, uh, we saw how so many part of the country was submerged by flooding, of course, uh, by Yester State, Kogi State, and the uh, partially part of Ikorodu was submerged uh, due to the excessive uh, projection of the rain, which is unfortunately, well, I wouldn't say unfortunate because it's an issue that we must Yes, you can see uh, this as it's, uh, it's been well flooded and uh, people are walking through the waters. Uh, there is no exit or drainage system for the waters to flow out of the road. Everywhere is almost flooded. And uh, now that the rains are back, I think the appropriate authorities uh, will swing into action before it becomes uh, something out of control. You see, people are apprehensive to walk through the rains, of course, the flooded uh, roads or third roads, which might have impact negatively on the durability of those roads, causing more, of course, of the tires, taxpayers' money in maintaining the roads, or possibly a total replacement of these roads. People are finding their way, trying to navigate uh, through any available or narrow uh, road to avoid, of course, contracting perhaps as, as some waterborne diseases. Uh, that might be exposed to, especially in these uh, flooding waters. Well, we hope that the government's attention will be brought to this uh, uh, emergency situation and, of course, uh, help to salvage uh, the situation before it, is be it becomes uh, out something. Uh, uh, that might become a colossal damage. I hope the Lagos uh, state attention will be brought to this. Sighting from a distance, you can see how the the motors or the vehicles are trying to swim through the the waters. A Lagos, a better Lagos is possible with the emergency units, of course. Uh, being proactive and uh, trying to clear off the drainage system and uh, uh, come up with implementation of how the drainage systems will be maintained on regular basis, not just uh, uh, the fire brigade approach uh, being deployed, uh, uh, which uh, is not uh, yielding any better result either. And there should be uh, an orientation or sensitization that people 
to stop dropping debris on the waterways. And uh, the waterways, of course, uh, where people erect some structures of business or uh, containers should be cleared off so that the waters can have a free flow. So, as far as possible, of course, uh, uh, calamity or flooding, which might impact negatively on the economy and the safety of the people or all our sundry in this uh, running season that is almost here. We are here once again reporting from News Inquest TV, keeping you updated on the happenings as they continue to unfold. Wishing you a lovely day ahead.